two Los Angeles Police Department officers who were fired for playing Pokemon Go and ignoring a robbery call in 2017 have failed in their bids to regain their jobs. Court documents published Friday reveal what led to the firing of former LAPD officers Louis Lozano and Eric Mitchell in 2017 and their unsuccessful appeal challenging the city's decision to fire them. According to the appeal, Lozano and Mitchell purposefully ignored a commanding officer's request for backup during a robbery and played Pokemon Go, a mobile game involving physically moving to different areas to catch Pokemon, while on duty. The two officers were on a footbeat patrol in the LAPD's Southwest Division in April 2017. It had been a busy day, with more calls than police cars available to respond, according to the appeal. Court documents say the division's patrol commanding officer heard a radio call for a robbery in progress with multiple suspects at the Crenshaw Mall. The ex-police officer's patrol supervisor, Sergeant Jose Gomez, tried to radio their unit to ask for backup at the mall but received no response. Gomez later met with the officers, who according to the appeal, said they did not hear the radio call and were at a park with loud music. Recordings from the officer's digital in-car video system, Dykes, later revealed that the officers had been close to the mall during the robbery and purposefully ignored the radio call about the crime and request for backup. They put out a radio code in a different area from where they were actually located, hiding that they were near the mall and hadn't responded to the call for help. I don't want to be his help, Lozano allegedly told Mitchell regarding the commanding officer who requested backup. The two ex-officers ignored a second request for help when their unit was called, the appeal says. Oh, screw it, Lozano said. Five minutes later, Mitchell told Lozano that Snorlax, a Pokémon in the mobile game, just popped up at 46th and Lemert. For the next 20 minutes, the officers were discussing Pokémon as they drove to different locations where the virtual creatures apparently appeared on their mobile phones. Finally, Mitchell exclaimed after apparently catching it, adding, the guys are going to be so jealous. When the officers were interviewed by Detective Tracy McClanahan, who conducted the misconduct investigation, they claimed they were only having a conversation about Pokemon Go and not playing.